Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today I have prepared two questions for you and the first question is Pyrotrichus flagella means and before I will give you an answer I want to help you to memorize different uh, types of bacteria depending on the presence or absence of flagella and position of those um, uh, flagella on the surface of the bacteria. So the first type of bacteria would be bacteria with no flagella at all, second variant would be bacteria with one uh, flagellum and the second uh, third variant would be bacteria with two flagella so this is plural and um, fourth variant would be bacteria with many uh, flagella on every side of the bacteria so how to memorize the names uh, first of all let's take a look uh, for example Imperitrichus consists of two parts peri first part which would be different um, in every name of the every type of bacteria and trichus would be um, the same in uh, all the names of these different types of bacteria so uh, if we take a look we can say that this is first type second third fourth type of um, bacteria we also can say a b c d so uh, here's uh, uh, a hint for you uh, the first type of bacteria we can say a trichus so the second would be monotrichus monotrichus it's also easy to memorize but the first uh, sorry um, the third type uh, we would need probably uh, some mnemonic technique and the name of this uh, bacteria would be amphitrichus so how to memorize for example amphi uh, reminds me Amphetamines, uh, this is uh, drugs uh, that uh, used to alter mood and also used as um, uh, stimulants. So if you compare this bacteria, once again, uh, this is mnemonic technique, it's not scientific method, it's just a way how to memorize. So, uh, so if we compare with uh, this type of bacteria, this type has two Flagella. And uh, of course would be uh, more uh, motile, uh, would uh, move with more ease and um, once again uh, people who take amphetamines uh, also can uh, be awake for many days or can dance for many many hours and this type of bacteria also because it has two uh, flagella probably also would move faster at least this is how we would memorize uh, by the way if uh, this bacteria want to move in this direction how it's going to move if it has to flagellum on the other uh, on the different sides but uh, in this type of bacteria only one flagellum would rotate so it if it wants to move in this direction only this flagellum would rotate if it wants to move in this direction only this one would rotate but never two uh, at the same time and the last one uh, would be peritrichus uh, so peri peritrichus uh, type of bacteria how to memorize for example I use uh, to memorize it um, this is petri dish and if we put bacteria in the middle uh, it would make a colony and would uh, grow in every direction so this reminds me peritrichus bacteria so petri and peri is very similar at least this is how it works for me I hope this also would work for you and uh, as you see the correct answer would be answer C so uh, Peritrichus bacteria is a type of bacteria with a flagella on every side uh, of um, surface of this uh, bacteria. By the way, E. coli also belong to this uh, type of bacteria. And the last question, what is plasmid? Uh, basically nothing to explain here, you just have to memorize that uh, plasmid is self-replicating segment of double-stranded DNA. Uh, it's can present it can be present in bacteria or 
it can be absent. Um, so this is answer A. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. Thumbs up if you like this video. Please write a comments, questions if you have any. Share this video with your classmates and see you in the next video. Goodbye.